Cappies on my Cappies, welcome to Vivid Vibration. My name is Christina. I hope that y'all are doing well. Cappies, we have the Shapeshifter and the Siren, the Shadow and Thanatos, Agape, the Eternal Child, and the King. I mean, <sighs> Cappies. I feel like there, there's something that, I don't know, it just feels like this, like, like a base level, and that's, and that's not to say that it's, you know, like no judgment, it's something that we all embody, right? We all have the light and the dark, but this feels like this dark energy that's just kind of like, I don't know, I just feel like somebody who's like, I'm gonna pull you down to my level. I don't know if you're dealing with somebody in this energy because it doesn't, I don't like take what resonates, how it resonates and leave the rest because these are general reads. Um, and I know a ton of copies, <laughs> but it, it and, and it could resonate differently for everyone. So obviously pick whichever side of the story you're on, but it feels like this very low level energy of like calling you down, I'm gonna bring you down to my level. But I feel like there is an idea here of, of no, there's a, there's a sense of purity that can't be, I don't know, I just feel like it, it can't be dragged down to that level. Um, and there's somebody showing up differently. I don't know, because this feels very predatory feels like somebody being preyed on, you know, almost like this, like this innocence of awareness that was going to be preyed on. And when it was preyed on, it was preyed on with like this, I don't know, because I just feel like somebody like giving someone a piece of candy. It feels very like seedy, <laughs> you know, to like pull them in. And I just kind of feel like whatever that energy is, it's, it's ending. Um, and I almost feel like instead of being this like naive person that can be preyed upon, you're, showing up as somebody who, who, I don't know, I just feel like knows I feel like knows a good thing when they see it, but I don't, I don't know if you're dealing with a completely different person or if somebody is shifting their energy or if you are shifting your energy. Again, these are general reads and they can play out in so many different ways, <laughs> but that's the energy that's here. It's, it's maniacal. It's, it's going to pull you down to my level. I'm going to find your weakness and, and drag you down. And then there's almost like this, like whoever it was, it was, in the position of being dragged down, they're like, not only did you not drag me down, but now I'm more aware, you know, now I'm, I'm better educated. I'm better, you know, able to make these decisions. Um, because I just feel like that, like that energy that was trying to, to drag you down, um, you know, like you, you pulled away from it. And when you did, I feel like you Pulled, pulled yourself back into your own power. Because instead of being somebody who can be preyed upon, I don't know, I, I just feel like you look different to somebody. I feel like somehow you look, you look less like a victim and more like a powerhouse. <laughs> I love that for you, Cappies. <laughs> Because you have the Nine of Pentacles, the Ten of Swords, the Ten of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles, and the Eight of Swords. I mean, there's just this. Well, because if somebody feels like they can prey on you, it's because they feel like you have a fear that they can, they can use that to their benefit. 
this for this energy that you're dealing it just feels like an energy who's like like they want to study you to find your weakness to use your weakness to bring you down to their level to get you to be where they want you to be so they can hold you in this place i mean it just feels yuck <laughs> it's a lot of yuck and i think you're seeing your way out of it and a lot of that i think just has to do with the fact that like there was like you stayed pure of heart And because of that, I think you're just, you're stepping into I feel like a value that's reflective of the internal value that you've held so true to. I feel like you're going to start seeing it in reality. And I love that. <laughs> Cappies. Okay. Here for this read. This is good. Let's see what else we can get for y'all. Two of Swords. Fortune Fairy. Well, I mean, the Two of Swords is a decision, and I just feel like whatever decision this is, um, it's that it's that energy that I mean, because the Shadow Dance is the devil in traditional tarot. But it's also a Cappy card. Um, you know, and, and the shadow side of that is, you know, like that manipulation and that control. But, um, you know, for this deck, shadow dance is more the idea of like, of a longing, you know, like watching something, wishing that it was yours. And I feel like that's that energy that was like trying to pull you down, find your weakness to bring you down to their level, to show you where you really belong. And I just kind of feel like you, you, you were like, that is not where I belong. <laughs> Um, and I, and I need to make some decisions that I, I feel like demonstrate that in my life. Um, and I feel like you're starting to make those decisions, um, still with this, you know, like, I just feel like there's still such a purity to, to your intention with what you're doing, you know, like you're, you're going to bring healing to the damage that was done by the people who were going to wrap you in an energy that is that was going to bring you down to their level and i just feel like you're like soap <laughs> they try and grab a hold of you and you're you slip right out um right on out and right on up to where you're meant to be and cappies i love <laughs> i love this energy okay Let's see what else we can get for y'all. <sighs> Justice. Two of Wands, Eight of Cups, The Magician, and The Hanged Man. Yeah, I don't know, because really and truly, it's just kind of like they're, you're parting ways with that, with that deceptive energy. Um, you know, you're parting ways with an energy that wants to bring you down to its level. You're parting ways with the lack of... Um, you know, you're stepping into your justice and I feel like your justice is, is the very thing that people were going to try and use against you. I feel like there's such a purity to your heart, Cappy, and there's such a genuineness in your actions. And when people want to play that, they play themselves. And I just feel like people who thought that you were going to be played I think they see it a lot differently now. Cause there's no, there's no, fear to be found where faith resides. And I love that. That's amazing. <laughs> Cappies. The kiss. Well, the kiss is like the best relationship card, in my opinion, <laughs> because it's intimacy. It's knowing that like, no matter what, um, you know, you can reach out your hand and somebody will be there. Um, and I don't know for maybe for some of my caps, there was this, like this energy surrounding your relationship, um, you know, that was like, it wanted to, to try and like bring your relationship to its knees and 
and you know like I'm really the one who's gonna be I don't know well because I know some caps that have like baby mamas and those baby mamas will do anything in their power to keep control over them but they're happy they're you know they've new baby mamas they've got new relationships you know what I mean but they've had to deal with those dynamics um, you know like you've got you know cappies in, in business and you know like you've got somebody who wants to bring you down to their level to you know like play dirty and you're like no you know like my ethics are above board and so you know like we're gonna have to part ways um, you know and where they thought that they could prey on you now you are like they're they're just playing the fool I don't know but however it resonates for you I feel like you are no longer um, I feel like I no longer engage in relationships that, that, that I feel the need to protect myself from. And so if I'm, I'm protected in my relationship then I don't have to protect myself. I can protect my future. I don't know, Cappies, I don't know how this plays out for you as an individual because, you know, like I said, this can definitely resonate differently for everyone. Um, but I feel like you're coming out on top. You're coming out, you know, like, I don't know, I just feel like refined by fire. Um, stronger, more decisive. And, and standing in a power that people thought they could play. And silly people. <laughs> All right, copies. Well, if this does resonate with you, please do give me a like, share, and subscribe, and I will see y'all again soon. Bye.